Hey guys, welcome to this jQuery Mobile in Cordova series. And in this video, I'm going to be introducing you guys to Cordova. And basically, what we're going to do in this video is we're going to be setting up Cordova so we can start building our mobile app. So basically, what Cordova is, it's a it's a tool which you can use to build apps using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Um, and it's you can use it for multiple platforms like Android, iOS, Windows, etc. And it's very it's very fast and it's very useful because you can add different platforms and run your app and it's just very good to use and you can use it with other you can use it with various programs like Ionic, Onsen UI but in this series we're going to be using it with jQuery mobile so the first thing we want to do is we want to set up Cordova so we can actually start with building our app so what we need to do is head over to control panel and we want to search go to system system and security and now we want to type in advanced the advanced system settings so good environment path environment variables and what we're gonna use is we're gonna have the java and node.js all we need to have those installed so I already have those installed and what we need to do is we need to add those now so first is we want to download node.js so head over to google and then you just click on this one for windows click on it and then it will prompt you to the through the um, directions and make sure you click on add to path then it will actually it will let you it will automatically add add it to the path so you don't have to copy the files and do it yourself second thing we need to do is that download the java jdk and I'll be I will um, make a link, set a link in the description to all of these different things you need to start up Cordova. So what you do is just click on accept and you just click on the Java JDK, click on that and it will download it and then what you want to do is you want to go to your downloads or wherever you have it find it um, I actually kept in the program files so here you click on Java and then JDK and then you copy the the path go to environment variables and then here that you want to define a variable called Java underscore home and then you want to give that this path click on OK and then now what we need is we need the Apache ANT and yeah and we need to get the platform tools so in order to do that we want we want to head over to the Apache ANT download. So just click on the latest one, and then just extract it because it's a zip file. Then you want to head over to wherever you download it. 
make sure you you know where you're downloading all these things um so I kept mine in the downloads folder and then just get the path of that see here I have my Apache ANT here so this is my path so copy the path define the variable ANT underscore home then OK and then now what we need to do is we need to add our things to we need to get um, our platform tools Android platform tools you just click on the SDK platform tools for Windows and then make sure you're keeping that in a folder which you can access and then you want to go to your path and then here you just add your the place where you kept the platform tools so I kept mine in the downloads So I'll just copy this and uh, paste it here. Alright, and for the Java JDK and the Apache ANT, make sure you copy the same the location of those files also in the path in this path also as well. So you have it here. So you should have everything that you download, all the paths stored in this system variable path okay click on ok and then click on ok um, and please join me in the next video for part 2 which we will be setting up Cordova thank you